Santa Claus from the recording studios at the North Pole. Our TV studio is warm tonight, and I want to hear you ask me questions. Mrs. Claus is going to be fielding the calls, and she'll say, hey, Santa so-and-so wants to know this or that. And if not, maybe I'll talk until people join in. And I want to welcome you all to 2020 Santa Claus Interactive Facebook Concert. Santa Claus, also known as St. Nicholas, Father Christmas, Kris Kringle, and simply Santa, is a jolly spirit of a man with legendary, historical, and folkloric origins who in many Western cultures brings gifts to the homes of the good children on the 24th of December, the night before Christmas. He has done this for hundreds of years and he shows no signs of slowing down. Santa is also the uncredited co-writer in his of many popular Christmas songs. He also loves celebrating the meaning of Christmas with others. Santa spends much of his time, the other 364 days of the year, teaching music to his elves, singing, practicing, and playing music. He also performs the training of many store Santas who serve him and constantly report to him. During late November through the 25th of December, he has been known to perform live Christmas concerts. As his elves and his army of retail Santas make preparations for his huge gift giving trip on Christmas Eve. After all, he has had hundreds of years to learn the many musical instruments and songs and plays. Then on Christmas Eve, with assistance from Mrs. Claus and his elves, a North Pole celebration begins. After everyone is thanked, he takes a deep breath, puts some boots together, climbs aboard his sleigh, and with the help of his wonderful abilities to slow and free delivers toys and goodies to the members of the world, all in one wonderful way. Dashing through the snow in a one-horse open sleigh, o'er the fields we go. Oh, 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 oh,
and all my friends all around the country. And I want you to know, Santa's been listening to your wishes and your le reading your letters and having all kinds of fun with Mrs. Claus up the North Pole. The elves have been working very hard for you. And they never forget a name anymore than I do. The naughty or nice book, I lifted up and almost broke my back. But because most of it was nice. So I hope you kids out there are going to have a great Christmas and your wishes come true. And of course you know that Santa has the famous bottomless bag. And my Christmas bag has no bottom because toys magically appear, transported from the wonderful northern light magnetic power of the North Pole into my bag. It's the same power that makes the reindeer fly and makes Mrs. Claus make me endless chocolate chip cookies. Deck your halls with chocolate chips. 
Jack Frost, he lets us be, and when done, the rings I pull, and we fly back up to the North Pole, I'm a jolly old elf who loves to deliver, because I'm king of the sleigh, I'm king of the sleigh, I'm king of the sleigh. Well, I think we can swing that. We'll call your loved ones and we'll find out what the status is. No one is beyond redemption. And when Santa's involved, he likes to really make it happen. So we'll see what we can do for you, okay? Yes. Also, there's a boy on here named Peter, and he wants to know how do you get down those chimneys, especially when you've been eating all those cookies. Well, Peter, I do eat a lot of cookies, and Mrs. Claus has put me on the chocolate chip cookie diet this year. Now, I used to eat Oreos all the time, but she was sure that if I just switched over to chocolate chip cookies, I would be okay. Now, that's not a diet for little boys and girls, because Santa needs extra energy to get everywhere in one night. But I do want you to know, how I get down the chimneys is different. The same glitterly, sparkly, so beautifully dust, the dust that happens up at the North Pole under the Northern Lights, and the magnetic pull of the North Pole creates the bottomless bag, it creates the reindeer to fly, and it enables me to slim down and get down them chimneys unburned. It's just like the fire goes out, I don't feel it, I come out now. You don't want to do that because you would get burned, but I have protection because of this glitter from the North Pole. And for a house without a chimney, or a fireplace I can get, like if they have forced air. I've made an agreement with all parents that are involved to be able to leave me a secret key outside the house somewhere so I can let myself in, look in on you, eat the cookies, drink the milk, eat the carrots to the reindeer, set out the gifts, off I go. I hope that answers your question. And Peter, be good. Pick up your room, clean up, Treat your loved ones with great respect, and we'll make Christmas happen the best it's ever happened. Up on the house top, reindeer paws, out jumps good old Santa Claus, down to the chimney with lots of toys, all for the little ones' Christmas joys. Ho, 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 who wouldn't go? Ho, 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 who wouldn't go? On the house top, click, 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 down to the chimney with good St. Nick. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, 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 oh. First comes the stocking of the little Nell. Oh, dear Santa, fill it well. Give her a dolly that laughs and cries. One that can open and shut its eyes. Oh, 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 who would know? Sing it with me. Oh, oh, oh. Chimney with good Saint Nick. The 
token stacking up little bill. Oh, just see what a glorious bill. Here's a hammer and lots of tacks. A whistle and a ball and a whip that cracks. Oh, 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 who wouldn't go? Oh, 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 who wouldn't go? Up on the house top, flip, flip, flip. Down to the chimney with the St. Nick. Sing it, oh. While going through grandma's dusty attic, I found an old box of Christmas stuff. As I carefully pulled each memory out with much gladness, remembering the love. Christmas snow globe home with me 
And on a shelf I keep it proudly displayed You see it's more than a memory For I have them with me every single day And now I get to go back and visit them on each Christmas Eve. For the ones who love me are all in there waiting for me. For the ones who love me are all there waiting for me. For the ones who love me are all there waiting for me. Yes. We have a little girl named Kim, and she wondered if you will say hi to Rudolph for her. Well, I'll tell you something about Rudolph. I use him quite a bit, especially when we have storms or fog or heavy snow. Now, you got to understand, most of the time I am traveling with the eight original reindeer. They're getting a little old, like Santa. You know, about 1,600 years old, maybe going on 1,700, I'm not sure. Rudolph was a new addition because his nose glowed. And of course, because Rudolph's nose glows so strong and so bright, the way I use him is I fly high into the atmosphere above the clouds, but when I have to come into a city for a landing, it's a very steep incline. And when we cut into that snow and ice and fog, Rudolph, boom, his nose just glows because he has that same magical element that the flying reindeer have. So you bet I'll say hello to Rudolph for you. And don't worry, because if it gets foggy, or if it's icy, or if it's snowing heavy, he'll be with me. If not, he'll be having a smart hot cocoa with Mrs. Claus at the elf celebration that happens once I take off. She says, thank you, Santa. Oh, you're very welcome. And I, I hear you've been a very good girl, and you read the nice book, so I am very proud of you for contacting me. It's really cool that you take care of everything at home. Be good to your loved ones and pick up after yourself. And again, I love chocolate chip cookies. I'll eat any cookie you give me, though. I love cookies. I'll even eat Oreos, there, though they're not on my diet. Don't tell Mrs. Claus. <gasps> Uh-oh. I think she heard me. Oh, she's laughing. That's okay. So, I also want you to know carrots for the reindeer, and if you don't have carrots, slice up an apple. They love apples. God rest ye merry gentlemen, let nothing you dismay, for Christ the Lord our Savior was born upon this day. To save us all from Satan's power when we were gone astray. Oh, oh tidings of comfort and joy, comfort and joy. Oh, oh tidings of comfort and joy. Blessed angel came in unto certain shepherds, brought tidings of the same. How in Bethlehem was born the Son of God by name. Oh, tidings of comfort and joy, comfort and joy. Oh, tidings of
they came to Bethlehem where our dear Savior lay. They found him in the manger where oxen feed on hay. His mother Mary kneeling down unto the Lord did pray. Oh, tidings of comfort and joy, comfort and joy. Oh, tidings of comfort and joy. Now to the Lord sing praises, all you within this place. And with true love and brotherhood, each other now embrace this holy tide of Christmas that other doth deface. Oh, tidings, comfort and joy, comfort and joy. Oh, tidings of comfort and joy. Mrs. Claus? Not yet. Do you have any for Santa? Why switch instruments? Well, I heard you say you were going to eat Oreo cookies. Oh, well, really, only if that's all they have. You know, we wouldn't want to turn down a gift, would we, from the kids? Oh, no. And, you know, Santa's been really good not eating any Oreos and making sure I eat those wonderful chocolate chips that you've allowed me to try. Now what I'm going to do here is a beautiful little song called The Gift. And uh... There was snow on the ground and there were lights. There were carolers singing every night. Sharing the wonderful gift that was given to me. The gift was given. The gift was given. A gift out. The gift. Isn't that a pretty one? And what it reminds me of is 
thanksgiving. Presents were given to the Lord. We give Lord take presents to each other with respect and love. We are really proud to give. So if you can, children, for Santa, I give to you so you give to others. Whether it's good behavior, taking care of an elderly loved one, or even helping out in the community. It's so important that we help others. Protecting me and preparing me. 
What a beautiful song about beautiful times. We love Christmas, don't we? Oh, you better watch out, you better not cry, you better not call time, I'm telling you why, Santa Claus is coming to town. I make a list, I'm checking it twice, I'm gonna find out who's been naughty or nice, Santa Claus is coming to town. I see you when you're sleeping. We having fun children and I know I have a, a special child out there watching her name's Kimberly and little John and what they're doing right now is they're kind of watching Santa to see if I do their favorite songs and Nathan and Nathan and Nathan, and Nathan is like one of my favorite honorary elves so we're gonna do a song about Santa Visiting.
behave so that Santa would come. Dad drove us out to the tree farm and we picked out a tree. Mom got out all the boxes full of the decorations to be.
hope you were all singing along. If you were singing along, that means it was getting all over the place and spreading out positive Christmas energy, which we all need right about now. It's been a rough year. Santa doesn't have health problems because he's Santa Claus and we live up at the North Pole and that's far away from all the stuff that everybody's had to go through this year. But as, as Santa Claus and Mrs. Claus want to tell you, be safe and be careful and have a good New Year come New Year's Day. We'll get through this. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. Jack Frost nipping at your nose. Yuletide carols being sung by choir. And folks dressed up like Eskimos. Everybody knows a turkey and some mistletoe. Help to make the season bright. Tiny tots with their eyes all aglow will find it hard to sleep tonight. They know that Santa's on his way. Lots of toys and goodies on his sleigh, and every mother's child is gonna smile to see a reindeer really know how to fly. And so I'm offering this simple phrase. Kids from one to ninety-two. Although it's been said many times, many ways. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry, merry, merry Christmas. Pretty, 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 pretty music. I'm the official sentry of the Island of Misfit Toys. Yes, you are. And I love that you kids are watching tonight. Oh, the weather outside is frightful, but the fire is so delightful. And since we know a place to go, let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Doesn't show signs of sapping. I brought me some corn for popping. The lights are turned way down low. Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. When we finally kiss goodnight. I'll hate going out in the storm, but if you really hold me tight, all the way home I'll be warm, and the fire is smooth dying, my dear, we're still goodbye, but as long as you love me so, let it snow, 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 let it snow. Such a pretty one. Such a pretty one.
Christmas tree. Hey, Daisy, take it easy, will you? You got me wrong. You want to come to Christmas? Well, I have feelings too. Now, Santa has to explain. Up at the North Pole, Mrs. Claus and I have four dogs. And their names are... Call them out! Well, we have Zoe. Zoe and Zuzu. And Zuzu. And Mr. Monk. And Mr. Monk. And Chicalina. And Chicalina Lou. And they're all beautiful dogs, but they all have the same problem when they get around a tree. I'm not like other dogs you've met who will teach me something and I won't forget why I was brought up to know the one place where I shouldn't go. I'll never do it on a Christmas tree. A Christmas tree is safe from me. Oh, what would Santa think of me if I did it on a Christmas tree? I'll never do it on a Christmas tree. That's one thing you'll never see. Oh, you just have to trust with me. Never do it on a Christmas tree. I'll soak an oak. I'll splash an ash. I'll do it on a peach or cherry. But if I'd sprinkle on a spruce, Christmas won't be merry. I'll never do it on a Christmas tree. Oh, what would Santa think of me? I'll hold it to eternity. I'll never do it on a Christmas tree. I'll never, 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 never do it on a Christmas tree. seem to care they'll sniff and do their business anywhere but i think it should be a crime to do it on a pretty pine i'll never do it on a christmas tree a christmas tree is safe from me oh what would santa think of me if i did it on a christmas tree i'll never 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 do it on a christmas tree
Thank you, everybody. Now, any other questions coming in, Mrs. Claus? No. So Santa has a pretty tight schedule he's following. And we want you to know we appreciate you showing up tonight and being our friends here at 777 Candyland Lane up at the North Pole. And from the North Pole to you, we're saying Merry Christmas, live well, and look for us on Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. You will open presents that you never thought you would have. Merry Christmas! Ho, ho, ho! Ho, ho, ho! Ho! Oh.